What's going on, folks? It's K Spade, the prospect. Back tonight with another NBA 2K15 My Career gameplay. Folks, we're in the NBA Finals. This is game three, and so far, my Cleveland Cavaliers hold a 2 0 lead on these San Antonio Spurs. But hold on. For what it's worth on this whole playoff run, we've been kind of hit and miss on the road. If we do slip up, it's been on the road. And this is our first game on the road in this series. So who knows how things are going to go. One thing I should let you guys know is that the Spurs have this power forward, number 21, Tim Duncan. The guy is unstoppable. He's been cooking us the entire finals. And the only thing that's been helping us out is the fact that the Spurs don't realize that we can't stop them. They keep letting other people do things. Right here, look, man, I'm down there trying to double team the guy. He kicks it back. That's a wide open shot from Manu. That's me. That's my guy who I should be guarding. But instead, I'm down here trying to help with Tim Duncan because he cooking my teammates. So we got to see how this whole thing plays out. Now, if you look at the way the game is set up right now, the Spurs are ahead. But I don't know. I don't really feel any pressure. Not just yet. All right. So, look, down low. We got a nice little defensive game plan going right here. We kind of trap that guy. We come up with the steal. I'm pushing the tempo. Stop. Pop. Bang maker. Boy, in transition, that's a heat check. And when the heat check going in, man, it's going to be a long day. At the same time, we still can't stop Tim Duncan. I, I, I might as well stop saying that because I don't imagine we're ever going to be able to stop Tim Duncan. But look at this. Pick and roll, kicking it back to my teammate who misses a dunk. Now, I don't want to murder the guy. I mean, miss dunks happen. You know what I'm saying? Rare, but they happen. Look at this. Here I am trying to bring the double team again. I realize that ain't even Tim Duncan. That's Boris Diaw. I get them light-skinned folks mixed up, but same result. He kicks it back to Corey. Who is that? Corey Joseph. And he bangs down the three. Still makes me play. At some point, I, I got to get right. But if you look at the game, like even though they're killing us, they're kind of not killing us. We're right here. I go into the post here. They bring the double team. I spin away from the double team to the baseline. Bang, bang. I'm nice in the post, right? You ain't seen a two guard with post game as nice as mine since Michael Jeffrey Jordan himself. Man, I'm telling you, everything was going right for us. So look, it's a tie game. I'm not going to show you guys much of the second quarter because the fourth quarter was so wacky. I didn't want the video to be super long. So we're going to get a brief view into the second quarter. Look at this. I hit him with the blender. Put him in the blender, y'all. I gave him the spinner Rooney. Kawhi had to file me. Look at Pop. Man, Pop, you know damn well that man fouled me. Come on, man. NBA players and coaches swear it's never a foul. I don't care how loud you can hear the slap on the wrist. They're going to say it wasn't a foul. All right? So I'm snatching a defensive rebound right here. As I told you guys, we're going to jump ahead. Second half action. And I kind of told you guys that on different nights, I will have a different role player. But well, a role player for tonight would be Anderson Verjao. He definitely brought his A game. Look at him right here converting a very tough shot in the post. That wouldn't be all we would see from Mr. Bears out either. The clown was definitely here today, man. He had his bag of tricks. It was going down, man. Look at this. I'm looking like James Harden right here and not just because we both got big beards. I was so focused on the shooters that I lost my matchup. Like Kawhi was behind me just getting loose. I didn't even see him. Straight James Harden moment, but it's cool. I'm going to get it back. Right here, I get the ball. Feel like I want to do some work. Wait just long enough to draw the double team. Kick it back to James. He gets it to go. Let's go, LeBron. All right, so LeBron is knocking down that midi. All right? If LeBron can contribute any, we going to be Gucci. And not only is he contributing, but the Australian sensation himself, Matthew Delvadova, banging down that rainmaker. It's still a close game here at the end of the third. Now, this should be that last possession of the third, but we come up with a big time steal. We're off, and I'm calling for it. You know what? I decide to attack the basket. Aggressive take. I miss it at first. But I get my own board and throw it back up. Now, that's how you end the third quarter. It's the tie game going into the fourth. The fourth quarter is going to be crazy, y'all. Trust me. All right. Fourth quarter action, man. My mindset is continue to get points, whether it's through me or anyone else. And I had three Spurs looking at me right here. So I get it down low to Anderson Vares, y'all, who was my guy for the night. And 2K does a great job of making your role players play. Kind of like role players look at LeBron for three. LeBron ain't there, but look who is, man. Anderson Verjao. 
But like I was saying, man, 2K does a great job of making your role players play like real role players. Like Anderson Verge, y'all won't get me this every night. Sometimes it'll be Tristan Thompson. Sometimes look at Anderson with the rock. Let me get that. Anderson Verge, y'all, let me get that off for of you. But tonight it was fair, y'all, man. And you know how fans do. Like, a role player have a good game and they'll start screaming MVP. Like, you ain't heard from that guy all season. But like I said, man, for the night, Anderson was my dude, man. So look at me right here. I'm trying to bait Tim Duncan. I kind of get a hand into his jersey. He takes a bad shot and misses it. We're running on the break. And look at that sexy bounce pass to Della Vadova. Beautiful. Everything that worked perfectly, man. So the game is kind of... Getting away from the Spurs. Great defense here. We force Tony, Tony Park into taking a shot that he don't want. And, man, I run off after the good defense. LeBron has great court vision, great passing ability. He zips it down the court, man. That's too easy. That's too easy. So, still, it's a two-point game because these Spurs wouldn't go away and that's another damn missed dunk. Now, at this point, I'm starting to wonder, like, okay, one missed dunk. You know, I guess it could happen. Two. Two in one game, I'm not really sure how I feel about that. Especially with it being a two-point game, but third. Boy, we get that right back. Manu lost me for a minute. I got back with some great defense and got the block. Della Vadova passes it, and that's the third missed dunk of the game. Now I got a damn problem, all right? Now hold on, 2K. Now I can take a missed dunk here and there. Three in one game is OP. So at this point, I'm worried that they trying to take the game from me. Until I see Manu miss a wide open three. I mean, that's something you don't see a lot, especially on Hall of Fame. And then they get it back to me for the mid-range. My mid is money. We already know this stuff. A little bit of cushion. That's what we need. Now, look at your boy here. Two minutes to go, man. I really wanted to pull that midi, but that's a great rotation. I kick it to Kyrie, who won't shoot. But I know who will, though. Let me get that. Rainmaker, boy. Let's go. So, I'm putting up the big-time performance in the fourth quarter. This is what a leader does. This is what LeBron should be doing, right? I mean, let's be honest. This is what he should be doing. Tim Duncan is still doing it for his team. That's a tough basket. He's getting it to go. Man, I'm catching, pulling, making it rain out here. Catch, pull, rain. Catch, pull, rain. And if I keep shooting like this, especially in the fourth quarter, it's not a team that can beat us. Like, it's really not, man. Still trying to get my teammates involved. They go hacker Tristan. He does get one. Now look at this. I turn the ball over. This is a crucial point in the game, man. Because even though we got the lead, and it's like less than a minute to go, the Spurs aren't completely out of it. And I told you guys the fourth quarter would be wacky. Watch this. I'm trying to prevent the pass to Tony Parker. They go to Kawhi, who I guess is afraid of LeBron. He goes back to Manu, and Manu just loses track of where he is on the court. He steps back to call a play and steps across the backcourt line, and that's their ass right there. So even though at times this game was ugly, man, I cannot believe we got a 3-0 lead on the Spurs. That's all I got for today, folks. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm out the next time, y'all. Hey, cut that out, man. For real. Cut this up. Put it on the feet. We supposed to be the losers, but we win it, no. They used to laugh at us, now we win it, no. They used to tell me never in my lifetime. I guess they wasn't in their right mind. Underdog. I ain't have a lot of shit back in my younger days. Had my daddy's temper, hitting up under my mama's waves.